first thing let's do is set up a project. And so we'll go to our projects tab. Right now we have one project, but let's add another one and I'll show you how to do that. Just add a project. And we'll call this one uh, an addition template. And uh, a typical addition. Okay. Now, the client, we don't have a client yet. We haven't set that up, so we'll say, no, this project's for our company. And features, uh, what features do we want in this project? Uh, risks is turned off. Everything else is turned on. To turn these things on and off, you just tap them once, and they'll turn off and on. And then we have category, and right here, let's see, we have, we're going to have to add a category, so let's add a category here, and let's call it additions, and create. Now we have the category. The dates, if you knew when the project was going to start, in this case is a template, we won't do that. You would just click that calendar and put the starting and estimated end date. And that's it. That's how you add a project. And now when you go to your projects, you can see under a better remodeling company, an addition template and the bathroom project. And if you go to an addition template, if you ever need to change the settings on it, you'll see the overview. This is just the activity that's going on right now, meaning it was created just now. And go to options, go to project settings. And when you're here, you can click on any one of these things, like an addition template, and change the name. You can, uh, the addition, I mean the description, you can change that. Any one of these things you can click on and change it, change the uh, general settings. And down here at the bottom, you can see all the project features that are on. Risks is off. Everything else is on. And then you can upload a logo down here. Okay, well that's it for uh, setting up your first project. And we'll go into that in more detail in future lessons.